Hi guys, today we're going to look at the Renogy MPPT controller, the 40 amp version with the Bluetooth module. So, plastic cover on the top, a instruction manual for the 20, 30 and 40 amp Rover series MPPT controller. There are some brackets and screws to secure it into place. There is a temperature sensor, which you only require for the AGMs and gel batteries. You don't use them on the lithiums. There is the Bluetooth BT1 module, which you plug in. You can use this on the Renogy app, on your phone or tablet, or you can also link to the Renogy One module display unit. There's a handbook for the Bluetooth module and a support leaflet for the various support groups around the globe. Protect it in polystyrene, bring it out. Black metal casing, plastic on the front here. I've had this out because I did a review with this and four other solar panels as part of the uh, Renogy kit. So if you want to check back, you can see how this sits with all the other bits that go with it. Within the handbook, there is the stickers for your van window and a warranty card to connect an e-warranty e card, scan in the QR code and register to your app. These are two year warranty products. So this comes for a 12 and 24 volt system. So here it is, the uh, Renogy 40 MPPT controller. It can take a massive 520 watts input at 12 volts or at the 24 volt version it can do 1040 watts at 12 volts that translates into 43 amps input and at 24 volts it would translate into uh, 22 amps input the challenge here is the voltage input at 95 volts when i reviewed this product earlier on as part of a bundle including the, the solar panels one of the feedbacks that I got was that the panels were bigger than the 100 watt weighting. So adding four in series, which you add the voltage, would mean this would top out at the 95 volts limit. And Renogy have told the people that gave me this feedback to put the panels in parallel. So that's something to bear in mind. If you've got four 100 watt Renogy panels, you might need to put them in parallel to use this function. Of course, you can have eight panels in parallel because of that 43 amp limit. I kind of like this shiny black metal casing and I like the fact that it's got some very large cooling vanes on the bottom. The cables are connected, so the battery is a plug-in plug -in unit on this terminal here and the B Bluetooth BT1 unit is plugged in here. You have to then use either the app on your phone, the Renogy app that is, on your phone or an iPad, or the Renogy One display module to connect to the Bluetooth to be able to see what's going on here. And the reason why you need that is because it's required if you want to use a user setting for your batteries. It does AGMs, it does gels, it does lithiums, but the user one is one that you can set up yourself. But again, you need to be connected to configure the unit itself. The other inputs are for the solar array and the battery out. Both of these units are screwed and they both are using six to eight AWG cabling. So there is a load unit here for 20 amps, which you can use to connect something like a fan or your phone charger or whatever and um, 
I kind of don't like that function. I'd rather use the power through a fuse block and switches so that I can control what's going on and protect the unit. But you might like that function, you might use that function. So please let me know how you use the load function in your world in the comments below. So this unit, it weighs about four pound. It is eight inches long, uh, six inches wide, and about two and a half inches tall. And I'll write the metrics underneath. I kind of like this unit. It's a nice size. It's told, I'm, I'm told that you need to fit it vertically or horizontally, but not flat. I suspect that's just to give it protection in case you get some water spilt on it. There's less chance of damage of water going into the electrics, etc. of the unit. If it's hanging this way, it's probably safer for everyone, all told. So, that's it really. Pretty simple. Pretty good little product. Not too expensive. Uh, and very, very popular. I'm Graham. This is Mogul Adventures. And thank you for watching.